we've just left the hotel, um, all packed up, it's travel day, um, I'm already in the mood about it. <laughs> <laughs> God. Not so much because we're going home, but like I'm looking forward to going home um, now. But um, the traveling part. It's the traveling, yeah. Um, so Craig's had a message off Tibby this morning, haven't you? Yeah. Just saying that um, we're still going at seven, and um, the flight, our flights departed from Gatwick, so that's on its way. Um, Craig's feeling a bit rough this morning, aren't you? Yeah, I'm alright. Yeah, it's getting a bit of a cold, I think. Um, so yeah, we're all ready. How was the cases this morning, Craig? Oh, oh Jesus. <laughs> getting a bit stressed out when we done a little bit. Just trying to close them? Yeah. Lloyd, that was the problem. Especially mine. Lloyd. And what was the way? Oh, sorry. Um, so Julie's um, was 23 and a half kilograms, <laughs> which are allowed 20. So this will be fun. Uh, Craig's was 20. Finley's was about 17, I think. 18. Like 18. 18. And Kenzie's was 15. Yeah, so the kids have got smaller cases than us, so yeah. um, I'm kind of hoping that with mine we've got a bit of leeway because the kids uh, Less. haven't got as much, yeah. So we'll, we'll see how that goes, but the reason that my stuff's so heavy is Bath and Body Works stuff. <laughs> Yep. So, I don't know what's going to happen there, so we'll see. So yeah, it's a long day. We're going to go to, we're on our way to Celebration now. We're about eight miles away. Um, going to have something to eat. And then, and then I don't really know what. Head to the airport. Yeah, just head to the airport then. And then, um, yeah, we've got to book the car back in at three. Um, so that, that'll be early, I imagine. And then, um, yeah, just kind of wait around at the airport, which I think is going to be pretty boring, but at least we're there and yeah. we've checked in and stuff. Yeah. So um, we'll catch up with you at Celebration. We just got to Celebration. Absolutely beautiful weather. Not a cloud in the sky, is the thing. Nope. Got another roast coffee? Yeah. Oh, yeah, look at that. <laughs> it's like a motorbike. Yeah. Type thing. Not sure if you can see. So, yeah, we're just going over to um, have something to eat now. Oh, yeah, there's a little corgi there. Cannot wait to see the dogs later on. Or tomorrow. Should be able to pick them up in the morning, but um, because the flight's delayed, um, it's going to be later on, like tea time. They have like two collection times, so got to go later. But this is flooded from Ian. Thanks for nothing, Ian. Is he just relaxing like little old men and the rocking chairs? It's quite busy, but it's Saturday, so um. So expect that. Yeah, I'm expecting that. Let's have a little sit down on the rocking chair. Yeah, we're This is the life. It's great. Are you, are you looking forward to going home? I could stay here another week. <laughs> go on, Vlasco. Go on, Vlasco. More times. Yeah. But, um, yeah, I'm, I'm glad to go home and see everyone and give them their presents and blah, 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 blah. So, yeah. Yeah. But I could stay here another week and get a lot of other roads done. Yeah, so. there's a lot of stuff we didn't get a chance to do, but unfortunately. I got to Gideon's. And yeah, that was one of the big ones, wasn't it? Mm. We wanted to do. But, yeah, um, this is what it is, unfortunately. We have to go home at some time. So, yeah. We'll go and get something to eat in a sec, I think. So the breakfast just come. That's my cinnamon pancakes. I've got chicken kites today. Yeah. Is that on you? Uh, I have no idea. What's the kind of that? Huh? What viewer? Chicken kites today. What have you right? Um burrito, breakfast burrito. Delicious. 
The sunshine is glorious. Isn't it Pip? What? The sunshine's glorious. Are we going in the dog truck? No. Best not. <laughs> yeah, I might spend another hundred dollars. Yeah. I think your dad might kill me if we go in there. <gasps> you all right? Nearly got them on camera then. So this is a car, we haven't really took a photo of it, but that's about it. There's um, loads of boot space, obviously it's filled with all our cases and stuff. Dad's having to move it around because it keeps sliding everywhere. Yeah, so and that's it's gonna doing his head in. So that's, 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 yeah, so that's it's an hour and 20 minutes to the airport, I think. Um, so we're gonna we're gonna go in a second but yeah this is a car should have had a smaller one but they give us a free upgrade which is brilliant i don't know what we'd have done with a smaller one because our cases wouldn't have fit in but yeah it's lovely we absolutely love it i'd love i love a big car anyway but um yeah so that's it i'll film a little bit of craig um, talking about the driving in a sec so we're in the car now pack um ready to, uh, on the way to the airport um so what are you saying about the car and driving yeah yeah it's good yeah yeah easy um a lot of people think that like you know i mean i never drove um on the other side of the road or in any other country or anything like that but it is it is really easy um you just get used to it i think yeah. There's a lot of like straight roads in yeah, there, whereas yeah. like in the UK, it's all like estates and Around roundabouts and, and traffic lights and all that sort of stuff. Yeah. So, um, but it's all just straight roads, really. Yes, yeah, it's, it's so easy. Something posted, sat nav will take you if you've got one in your, your car. Yeah, so. ours is played up a little bit. Auntie yeah. sat our sat nav, but we've the kids have put their phones on and we've managed. Manage find everywhere yeah, we needed yeah. to. Yeah, it is really easy. Always say, like when you get in your car and stuff like when you're picking it up, just you know, make yourself aware of everything, where everything is, indicators, all that kind of stuff, and, and then yeah, it should be alright. Yeah, it's quite easy. <clears throat> so, there's no real, um, like, <laughs> that's you. Thank you. There's, um, oh. there's the th so when you get to traffic lights you can turn a couple of the things that um you can do is you can turn right when the lights are on red if it's safe so which is really strange, strange thing yeah. Yeah. to do um you can do that what else is there uh, you can't else? go past the school bus when the yellow lights are on yeah that's illegal the, when you just the, got to stay behind it, you can't yeah. go past it because that means the children are, are getting out of the bus or something like that. Yeah. So you can't. It's no matter what, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, no matter what. Um, the lanes, you can stay in any lane and people just go around you. you don't, there ain't no like fast lane and slow lane or middle lane, nothing like that. It's literally, you just drive and then people just go around you. Oh, whatever. You can't, it's not um, the thing to flash people as well. So, yeah, like in the UK, that's we illegal. obviously like, <coughs> excuse me, flash people if we want them to go or flash them to say thank you. Or, you know, we do do that a lot. Um, but you can't do that here. It's just literally just give them a little wave and, yeah. and that's kind of it. Or just, you know, do that sort of thing, gesture so they can go. Um, there's the lights flashing. The um, orange lights. Orange sure. lights, yeah. Yeah, it's where there's like uh, emergency services or something like that. that yeah, so you to. give them priority, yeah. obviously, if the, which you would anyway. Um, so yeah, it's pretty straightforward, really. It's an automatic, isn't it? Yeah. Um, I, the plan sort of was that I was going to be doing most of the driving, and I haven't done any. <laughs> so um, I drive a manual car in the UK. Craig does now, but he used to have. Um, used to have an automatic didn't you so yeah. he, he does he does like them and he is yeah. familiar with them um because i've never drove one before I, I didn't even want to give it a go to be honest 
but there's been no need like Craig's been doing it all the time and every day and he's been fine with it really comfortable like so yeah I think you were a bit apprehensive weren't you when we first came yeah, yeah, yeah. It's because you've never be. done it, you yeah. just don't know, do you? So no. you don't know who it's going to be, or you know, where the other drivers on the road is going to be, but it's so easy. It's yeah. So easy. What about the petrol? Yeah, filling up, yeah, the petrol's um, really strange because you pay for it before you put it in. Yeah, you put it in basically. So you have to, you know, pull up, go in, and say, I don't know, 40 $50, whatever, and then you come out and then put it in. And, it, and it'll go straight to, like, it'll, you, you can leave it on as, as, as long as you want and then it'll just literally cut off after the $40 sale, what you've asked for. Yeah. You don't go over, you don't go, you know, it, it's... It should be should be in the UK yeah, like yeah, that, Yeah, yeah, it'll stop all the uh, people, like, pulling off with petrol and stuff like that, wouldn't it, you know? Yeah. So, um, I find that, I find that pretty good. Um, yeah, you just go up, say I want 40 on, on number six or whatever, and then you'll say fine, and then that's it. You just go out, put it in, off you go. Easy. Yeah. Very easy. So it's better, isn't it? Yeah. And there's pet, uh, petrol stations everywhere. Yeah. Everywhere. So we've got to fill this up before we yeah. drop it off. Um, obviously, as you do. Um, yeah, I don't think... Craig doesn't seem to think that you have to do MOTs here either. No, I don't think you have to do So, so. Um, we kind of think it because there's some cars driving around with like big pieces missing <laughs> off, off it in the UK wouldn't be roadworthy um, like bumpers missing and all that sort of stuff <coughs> oh you alright there? yeah sorry <laughs> um, yeah so um, yeah some of the cars are a bit a bit rough and a bit questionable but they're fine so um, yeah there's a lot of trucks as well like this is a this is a big truck, but there's some that are absolutely oh, humongous. Absolutely amazing. I, I absolutely yeah. love them. I, I would love one, um, but I think I probably struggle to park it. <laughs> They're absolutely Massive, ginormous. Yeah. yeah. So um, yeah, that's just a quick little overview of the driving. Um, so basically, if anybody's coming out and they're going to be driving, don't panic about it. But like Craig says, just find your bearings first in the car before yeah. you. There's no rush to get out of the airport slide. When, yeah. when you, if you're renting your car from the airport or anything like that, there's no rush to get out. There's nobody there saying, come on, hurry up or anything. You just literally get in and then just, you know, take as long as you need. There's, mm. no, there's no rush or anything like that. Yeah. Yeah, so, um, so that's about it, really. So we'll catch up with you when we get to the airport. Um, should be about an, an, hour. an hour. Yeah, exactly, an hour, actually. So we'll catch up with you then. Bye. Hello. Hi. <laughs> so, so we, we still have absolute no idea like what's going on. So we've dropped the point. car off. Yeah. We've checked Sorry. in. You checked in, didn't you? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Asked yeah. him what was going on. Yeah. Nobody seemed to have a clue. No. Nope. There was a little um, two stand, so I went up to them and asked them. Um, spoke to a lady who said it a flight so the last we thought our flight was at seven o'clock and then we were stopping off at Dominican to pick up flight crew. So I asked the lady and she said, Oh no, yours is still scheduled, you shouldn't have any problems, it's twenty past five. Um I said, Oh we, are we stopping off? She said, No, no, brilliant. Goes back to Craig, Craig's like, Oh, apparently we're flying at eight o'clock. <laughs> like, eight o'clock. And, like, we're, and we're stopping off in Dominican. And we're stopping off. Anyway, of course, a very long story short, um, our boarding passes say 20 past five. We are stopping off still, but mm. they've given us, uh, they've given our um, seats, somebody seats else. away. So um, we paid for extra leg room, um, just for obviously a bit more comfort. And we would have been split up, but now we are all together in a row of four um, at the back, but we won't right have extra at, leg room. Right at the back. So the flight's supposed to be, what, an hour and a half to Dominican? Yeah, yeah. From here, then it's literally half an hour on the ground just to pick up the flight crew. Then we go again. So we are going earlier than what we thought. So well, we that's don't know a bonus. Yet. Yeah, well, I won't believe it till we're on it, no, to be honest. Normally. Our plane is currently in the air coming over to us. So, um, yeah, we're just going to have to see what happens. But none of the two we... Staff no idea. Had a clue what they're doing. So, um, yeah, 
quite stressful, isn't it? But it's only a small airport, luckily. Luckily, there's, it's quiet. There's not a lot of stuff going on because um, it's just two is, so. Um, but saying that, they should know what's yeah. going on. Yeah, they should, yeah. Shouldn't yeah. they? So, um, yeah, well, we're very early. What time is it now? Oh, we're very early. Quarts two. Quarts two, so we're really early anyway. So we'll just chill out and... Um, Who knows when we're going to be getting on the plane. So I'll catch up with you in a bit. So another update. Um, we're supposed to be flying at five to eight now. I've literally got no words. Everybody's absolutely fuming. The plane coming in hasn't landed still. What time's that, Jill? Six o'clock. What time is it now? Five past four. Um, I haven't got any words. I have not got words. Well, I have got words. <laughs> I just can't say them. Yeah, very annoyed. We're all just sat about. Everybody's. Everyone's annoyed. Everyone's delayed. Yeah, so we're supposed to take off at five to eight. Then to the Dominican. Quarter past nine. Then home. What time are we supposed to land in Gatwick? Five to twelve. Five to twelve. And got a drive home from there. Can't find the house keys. Is there any house keys? Are there? No. I've looked. So, so if you're in the car, you've lost, you've lost it. I think they're in the case, you know. in the top. God, I've power moods. I don't know. <laughs> the time we get home. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Try to be positive, but it's very hard. We're tired already. <laughs> yeah, so we'll update you when we're finally on the plane because I don't know what time that'll be. Yeah, it's good sleep. Yeah, it's quite good. I've had a six hours sleep. So, uh, any go about now, on hour 15 left. So we're, how long were we on the plane for? Was it? 
eight hours ten on the way back, but yeah. then you got the two hours to Dominican. Then you got the hour wait. Yeah. Yeah, of course you'll have an hour. So um we yeah, we had our extra leg room seats taken off us so they that crippled us as well. Um not only that, then we've put to the back of the plane. Yeah, so there's loads of turbulence. <laughs> we didn't impress at all. <laughs> so we're driving back now, finally. It says we should be it's ten to four now and it says we should be back for five to six. The cut off time for getting the dogs is six. So I've asked if I can, if I'm able to get them after or if it's gonna to have to be tomorrow morning, so I'm just waiting to hear off them. Um yeah, Finn's managed to go back asleep again after having six hours on the plane. Good for him. Yeah, good for him. Um so yeah, we're absolutely shattered now. We just wanna get back and chill out and have a nice cup of tea. Can't wait. So yeah, we're like zombies. So um I'll vlog again when we get back. Um and then that'll be the end, end of our um holiday vlogs. Hi. Um so we obviously we're back home now. Yeah. Um we've been back for two weeks, so we're a bit um late finishing the vlog off. Yeah. Um we didn't do anything when we uh obviously didn't vlog anything when we got back because we were yeah, absolutely sure. exhausted. Yeah, um yeah, it was a long uh, I can't remember the last bit we put on. I think it was in the car yes. coming back. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah. So it. How long did it take us to get back? Three hours. Three and a half hours to get back from Gatwick to here. Yeah. So. So it, it's a long drive. And yeah, and it was a long flight, and it was exhausting for us all. So, yeah. As soon as we got back, um, I went straight out to collect the dogs. We yeah. were late. I was late collecting them, but the lady said that she'd hold on, so I, I got them a bit late. Um, but brilliant um so at least i got to see him yeah. um that day and then you took the kids back didn't you yeah, so yeah. they went back home and um, straight away and um, they were shattered and obviously wanted to see their girlfriends and stuff so um yeah that that was it we come back and well you come back and we just slept then didn't we yeah. to, to bath the dogs yeah, <laughs> yeah. from kennels but mm. um yeah, and then we just slept then, didn't we? we well, yeah. I think we stayed up a bit later than I thought, actually. I can't yeah. actually remember the time, but I know it was, yeah, it wasn't early. Yeah. But I think then the next day we didn't get up to like, like dinner time or something like that, did we? Because no. we just absolutely shut. And then it took a couple of days then to get back to normal, some kind of normality with like sleeping, yeah. and obviously with a jet lag and stuff like that. So, yeah, yeah it was fine. Yeah, so we had yeah. a brilliant holiday. Amazing. Um, exhausting, but yeah. brilliant. And, um, yeah. yeah, the kids really enjoyed it. They loved it. Yeah, yeah, um, so our next vlog we'll do probably maybe tomorrow. Um, will be like a bit of a, it's it's a bit of a whole one, but we didn't buy loads of stuff, no, so no, it's just no. a few bits and yeah. bobs, yeah, and yeah, then yeah, yeah. we'll talk nice a bit stuff. about the holiday and what our thoughts were and stuff, and um, show you some bits that we bought. Yeah. Um, yeah, and just um, and just take it from there. So. Thank you for watching our holiday. Thank um, you. We hope you enjoyed it. We're just yeah. obviously just starting out vlogging, so you know we might think we could do better. Like, please let us know in the comments. Let us know. Yeah, yeah. We, we, we only can get better if people yeah, tell us. Yeah, yeah. Um, we don't want to be boring. Um, but we'll yeah, just let us know what your thoughts are. Um, and um, we'll catch up with you soon. Thanks for watching. Thank you. Bye. Bye.